Hey everyone, I know that it has been like a pretty long time and so I have cold so because of that uh, my nose I might be sniffing here and there and my eyes are a little bit red so anyways getting to like the last time that I vlogged it was regarding my skincare routine then I had that whole like crazy um, Korean mask okay so after that was like the first time with the uh, face mask and since then I have like grown into it and I have a little bit more knowledge of it I guess and so I just wanted to share my experience with you all and the last time I did a blog someone suggested me that Irene why don't you put like a headband on your hair because the hair like kind of kept falling while I was trying to put on the mask and everything and it was like kind of irritating so I completely agree with that so I have a headband on today <laughs> so anyways a lot of messages thanking me some of them regarding my skincare routine and how they also had like a lot of acne problem and you know and how I use and you know what other products should they try and taking suggestions from me and thank you for trusting me with your skin and I know it's a big deal because you know as girls who doesn't want a good clear skin I mean even men also but some of them good look with acne so I guess <laughs> I don't know so anyways um going back to last like you know when i blocked regarding the korean face mask and i think it was like a snail secretion so i made a mistake after that um i had that other canola honey face mask and i think everyone must be aware of this you know charcoal uh, face mask that has been going around the internet for quite some time especially like even on my instagram page i see a lot of advertisements you know advertising this product and i was like okay i need to get a hold of this and I really really need to try it out which I did I think I should do a video on how painful it actually is and it's nothing like how they show on the video but yes it's really effective in terms of taking out the white pores and you know the black pores in that way it's like pretty effective so it's good and what happened was after you know uh, using this uh, charcoal face mask and you know my pores like literally all the white heads and the black heads like come off and your pores is like hot fresh you know what I did was I used the canola honey face mask and oh my god I think that was like the biggest mistake and from there on I learned that if you have oily skin and if you have like an acne prone skin like me do not use sweet any like fruit or any face mask that has to do with honey because it literally pop out the pimple like in a few hours i was not even kidding like after i used a canola face mask and that was i think a day after i used this face mask my skin like overnight it had about five pimples that just popped up on my face and thank god for tea tree oil i could save myself yes so that happened so i'm so excited because i have been trying like i said a lot of face masks and if you don't believe it yeah see this I can literally open a face mask shop in my bedroom <laughs> so anyway so I have been like using um, Innisfree for quite some time now and this is like so cute this is the welcome packaging that they gave me and I really like Innisfree because um, it was given to me as a birthday gift from one of my like really super close friends and I really like the product and that's when I decided to try their face masks and everything which are like super cheap and which is super affordable so I really liked it and industry is one and the other one that i use these days are from the face shop so these both are like korean brands and uh, both of them have like a variety of products that you can select from depending on your skin type obviously and this uh when it comes to industry i really like they have one on tea tree and then they have this one called i think it was jiju I, I don't remember um, yeah I think it's called no not GG it's Bija so they have this uh, Bija and uh, tea tree face like capsule pack I think yeah so this one is like really nice okay and I finished using the other one which was the super volcanic pore clay mask I have like a free sample kind that they had given me so I have this one so these two have been like really good in terms of like face masks okay and uh, clay mask to be specific and I really like it so you guys can try this one out but today I will be trying out their face mask so 
Yes, so they have the um, Innisfree, they have uh, tea tree and they have the Jija face mask and which I, me and my sister, we used it and it was like really, really, really good and I really loved it. I'm sorry, it's Bija. It's Bija and not, why do I keep saying Jija? It's like so stupid. So anyways, um, so the face shop is something that I discovered while searching online for, you know, face masks and I have like quite a lot i think right now i have about 15 products of theirs uh, my industry face masks i've already used them so i don't have many of that actually right now so today i think let's experiment oh industry i have like okay so if you have like i say acne prone skin so the other one i, I wanted to try out was this like the lime one and the bamboo one i've already tried out the tea tree and the bija I hope I'm right this time. Yes, I'm right. So the Bija one that's like really really good. So I want to try this one out. Okay, so this is from the face shop and I have like nearly 15 pages. <laughs> I'm so excited like these are like my babies and I'm like should I even use them? Okay, so they have like different different kinds. So I have the avocado. Then I have a solution soothing face mask. I don't think I'm gonna go with this today. So goji berry, I don't know what this is, I don't know whether it's like sweet or I don't know, so I have to try this out. So I'm excited to try this one, rice, because I think rice should be healthy for your skin. Green tea, obviously, I'm sure it's gonna be good. Oh, I have another avocado, then I have the red ginseng, so I've never heard of this, so... Well, this seems to be good, okay, so I have a lotus, I have cucumber, I have aloe vera, okay, this one, blueberry, mm, not for me, it's, I got it for another friend who has like really, really dry skin, so I want her to try this out and I want to see how like useful it will be for her skin, kelp, I don't know how this is, okay, another rice, another, and white tea, so, oh, my nose is running right now. So, um, I think I'm gonna go with the green tea. Oh, no, actually, I should go with the rice. Okay, I'll, I'll go with the rice one because I think this is gonna be good for my skin. So, all of them have like the same way you have to apply when it comes to the face shop, and I think that you can do this for any of your face masks. So, um, in terms of like how to use it, in terms of the direction, it's wash your face. Okay, and then apply the toner, pull out mask and carefully place on the face and remove after 10 to 15 minutes and pat the face lightly to absorb the remaining essence into the skin. So what is the use of the Face Shop Real Nature Rice Mask Face is the brightening mask sheet with rice essence softens and brightens rough darkened skin. I don't think I have darkened skin right now, so I think I'm going to change the face mask all together. Yeah, I think I'm going to change it. So what for? So for the green tea face mask, it says that it soothes the skin irritated by environmental stressors, refreshing and revitalizing it. Ooh, I think I'm going to use this one because I am a little bit stressful these days regarding what I don't know yet um, so the application is the same way yes I think the rain are stressing me out because I hate the rain so much so I think I'm gonna use this one so I forgot to wash my face so I'm just gonna go wash my face and then I'm gonna apply my favorite tea tree toner as you all know I just love it so much and like I've used like three fourth of the bottle guys this is the best toner as I blogged about it earlier so I'm just gonna go wash my face and apply the toner and be right back so I'm back I am done applying my toner and we're gonna move to the next step now so because I feel stressful thanks to the drains I'm gonna try the white tea so all of them have like their own reasons of why you should apply it but this one dark skin i don't know how it's gonna work but i would like to try this one so let's dip into this okay here the other thing that i didn't read out was it is drenched in a clear serum formula without added parabens so yes let's try 
Get out, people. So excited. This is the white tea. The face mask from the face shop. Ooh. So the only fr uh, difference with the one that I had used earlier on my blog was I think from again I keep forgetting nature banana or banana nature is this is like more tissuey like the product material and the other one was more on the like plastic kind of like gel yeah Oh my gosh, okay, so I have to put this on my face. I hope I will do better than last time because last time I was so horrible that I had to pause my video, get it fixed, and then come back on screen. Okay. Oh. Ooh. It smells good, guys. For the nose. Hmm. Oh wow. There's like can you see this? Like this is a lot of product you guys. This is amazing. Hmm. So I'm gonna keep this for 10-15 minutes. So wash your face, apply toner, pull out mask and carefully place on face, remove after 10-15 minutes and pat face slightly to absorb remaining essence into the skin. Alright, so I'm gonna see you guys after 10-15 minutes. So the 10-15 to 15 minutes are done and unlike the other one, this is like not totally like dry it up. Oh wow. It smells so nice. Maybe because it's like the material is more of like the tissue type, so it's all there's like excess product actually. So. Why waste some money and why not use whatever other product is there on your other parts of your skin? Because there's like quite a lot. See this? Wow. Okay. My sun coming out. So, see that? It's so much of product. Oh my. So, once you're done with this, just keep your skin like this and let it dehydrate. Oh wow. So, I hope there won't be any pimples popping in like last time when I used the um, canola face mask like I shared earlier because it was like too sweet and I have an oily skin and it just didn't go with my skin but hopefully this one and I'll let you guys know maybe on my next vlog if it affected my face like badly or it actually made my face better <laughs> So yeah, so I have like so many other face masks to try and I think after I've tried like all of these The ones which are for acne prone skin and other skin type and not the sweet one like I got for example like this berry one So not going on my skin. So um, let's see. So I will keep you guys updated and like I said industry and the uh, face shop are like true and like brands which are very much available here in india and you can totally try them out you guys oh the face feels so good so until next time <laughs> and yes um a lot of you have been requesting me to do like a makeup tutorial kind of um video so i tried doing that last time and it was so noisy, I don't know what was happening below my building but it was like so noisy so I didn't like the video 
um, so I will try to do like a new one soon because I have new makeup products and I'm so excited to try them on so yes I'll see you guys soon hopefully and take care and enjoy the monsoon and don't hate it as much as like I do oh my skin feels so good bye guys <laughs>